I'm recording now. <laughs> I got a lot of editing on this. So I'll need a lot of shit to take out. Like <laughs> this? Yeah, pretty much. Why not? Why don't you just leave it? Because I'm lazy. Wait, if I was lazy, I would leave it in. Yeah. <laughs> what is up, everybody? Got a quick little update video for a new AR game coming out soon. Um, about like three months. 12, 12 o'clock, it's now almost 1 p.m. Central Time, so about an hour ago. Uh, GoHub tweeted out this article. Due to growing interest from our readers and forum members, we're publishing a post about Jurassic World Alive. If you have time to fill out the survey in the end of the post, we want to see should we cover the game or not on a separate site. So basically they're asking if they should cover any of this game when it comes out or leading up to it on GoHub or on a different site. So if you want to go help them out with their survey, I'll leave a link to that down below. Shout out to that darn bat right there <laughs> for creeping up on me. So let's get into what this actually is. Oh, I'm a big fan of Jurassic Park in general. Jurassic World was great. I'm excited to see the new Jurassic Park movie coming out this summer. Is there one movie or Because they came out they, the second one. Yeah, that's the one coming so, out this summer. Is the second one. I thought it was the third one. Cause it was no. Second. No. Or the third one comes out next year, isn't it? Yes. Alright, so we got... So confusing. If you look to one side or the other, I don't know where I'm going to put it at. Jurassic World Alive, AR mobile game, roaring its way to you this spring 2018. So, obviously it's going to be cartoony, but still got that realistic feel to it. This is not a drill. If you'd already heard about it, yes, it is true. Every little kid's dream is about to come to life. A location-based technology and augmented reality AR mobile game about Jurassic World is in the works and scheduled to be released this spring of 2018. So, spring. That's what we're shooting for. And if you look at this picture, I'm really hoping that that's how the graphics are. I mean... That'd be badass. Yeah, it would be badass. I have to agree. Um, let's see. Unlike Wizard Unite, which is being developed by Niantic Labs, Jurassic World Alive, a Pokemon Go style game oriented on dinosaurs from the Jurassic World universe, is currently being developed by a Montreal based company called Ludia in collaboration with Universal Studios. Ludia has previously developed various branded mobile games ranging from Jurassic Park slash World, Battlestar Galactica, Family Feud, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, so this is not their first rodeo. It is, however, the first step into the location-based and AR technologies. My question is: Is it free? Since it's, run, it's since it's done by Universal Studios, is it is it going to be like Pokemon Go, where you can play it but have the option to buy stuff from the store? Probably. Or do you have to pay like ten bucks for it? For like a season pass? Yeah. Kind of like how Fortnite's doing. <laughs> but uh. In Jurassic World Alive, players will act as new recruits from the Dinosaur Protection Group. Their main task will be to discover and protect dinosaurs from around the world. Players will have to locate dinosaurs on the map and deploy an in-game drone to retrieve DNA samples. This will allow them to breed genetically modified dinosaurs in a lab. Stop right here. <laughs> Anybody remember from the original movies what happened when they genetically modified the DNA? Like, anybody? What happened? Or even in Jurassic World? What happened? Nobody, nobody cares. Nobody cares. <laughs> All I see is... I can't remember his name, but... Yeah, literally that. The guy sitting at the table being told <laughs> yeah. not to do it, and the other guy's like, see? see? Nobody cares. Anyways, moving on. Get your, uh, uh, uh. And then engage with other players around the world in real-time PvP arena battles. Allow them to level up and earn more rewards. Niantic, this company is probably going to blow you out of the water because they have PvP battles coming. Well, that's if it's any good to play. 
And it's free. It doesn't matter if it's any good to play. PvP battles in a mobile AR based game when we were promised an PvP battles and trading in our mobile based game. <laughs> so, anyways, the launch of the game will con coincide with the theatrical release of Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom, scheduled for June 22nd, 2018. All we can hope for is that Ludia has taken John Hammond's words of wisdom into consideration and has spared no expense in the development of Jurassic World Alive. This game will certainly and finally make a lot of kids and adults dream come true. Here's the teaser trailer of the game. So, I'll leave a link down below to their website. So you can go register for, like, pre-register for the game. You receive a free Rare Incubator when the game launches. The game will be available for iOS and Android both. So there's no, oh, I need to buy a, an Apple device or I need to buy an Android in order to play this. It's going to be for both. And also it's fun. Pre-registering, get free stuff. Why not? Wait, so you do get, do you get an incubator for the Jurassic World you get, game? You get the free inc no, you get the free incubator for the Jurassic World game when it comes out. That's what the whole pre-registration is. Mm. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm wondering how they're gonna how they're gonna do it though. Like I don't know. I don't know how they're going to do it. So I'm hoping it's like Pokemon Go and the upcoming Harry Potter game. And I guess kind of sort of like Draconia Go was, where it's it's obviously going to be GPS based. You have to travel around and find dinosaurs in the wild, fly a drone in game, capture their DNA, go back to your lab wherever that may be, which more than likely will be like your item inventory slot from Pokemon Go or your Pokemon inventory. Or maybe they'll do what we've been talking about and have it to where it's like your like house. set at your house. That'd be cool too, like if it's set at your house. Like how in Draconius Go you can set up an arcane table anywhere, pretty much. Don't mind arcane. And use it. We've been saying that Pokemon Go needs something like that for it. your own personal Pokestop that you can put up somewhere, take out, like or, put away. Or just, or just have leave it. it up indefinitely. Like say, I want to leave it up indefinitely here at our house so I don't have to walk in the cold or in the rain or whatever to the nearest Pokestop just to get my streak for the day. And it's only registered to you. And it's only I registered to your it. account. So if they do something like that with like lab for the game where you can set it up wherever you want to, like I said how Draconius Go did, you can set it up wherever you want to, that'd be cool. Or it's in your inventory tabs, all that. But, or the gyms, or if they do it like a gym system. Or gym system. I don't. Honestly, I really don't know. Not a gym system, Hopefully, like, GoHub actually does cover it. So, if you could click on the link below to go to their survey, help them out, let them know, so we can get more information on this. I would like to play it and actually add it to the channel in the future. So, if you enjoyed this, this new hyped-up topic of Jurassic Park, Jurassic World a live AR game, please leave me a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, I'm working on getting 600 subscribers, so help me, help me out, help us out, <laughs> so follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, I'm active daily on that, more than I am on my YouTube channel, which is sad, <laughs> getting better, alright, so, I am more active on Twitter, alright, shush, so, like I said, like, subscribe, turn on the notifications so you don't miss an, any future updates on this game or Pokemon Go or pretty much anything that I feel like putting up. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. All the links will be down below or on the About Me section on my main page. <laughs> Is that so? Alright, can you say bye? Can you say peace out? Look right here. See, like right there, look right there. Say bye. Say bye. No. Can you say bye? No. Bye. No. All right. Bye. No.